Well, popular musical from the 1990s is once again wowing theater lovers. And one thing I won't even shine your shoes. The musical review Smokey Joe's Cafe is back on a New York stage. And two of the stars, Dwayne Cooper, who you just saw there, and Emmer <laughs> Demma Tegerstedt, join us live in studio this morning. Welcome. Yes, Good thank morning. you for having us. Of course, well, the, music the musical features some of the biggest hits in pop music from Jerry Lieber and uh, Mike Stoller. What is it like? I mean, Cindy and I, first of all, we saw the show yesterday. We both had the same reaction. Wow, they are all so talented. Yes. <laughs> and just, and, and the energy, yeah. the energy. What is it like for both of you? Uh, it's a workout. <laughs> but, uh, it's, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. I think that the thing that I like the most about it is it appeals to not only the older generation, but the younger generation. Mm -hmm. So we get to take people through this journey of where this music started and um, where we are today with the current yeah. trends. And so it's, it's a lot of fun. It's mm -hmm. impossible to go into work with a bad, you know, mood mm -hmm. and not be uplifted ourselves. So the fact that we get to do that for the audiences as well, it just, it's impossible to be tired. I mean, yeah. the songs are bit. just so... Yeah. 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 speaking for yeah. you. Yeah. Right. We are actually so grateful you're coming in because both of us were blown away about how much it takes to do what you did because yeah. you all are performing 40 songs back to back to back, yeah. no dialogue, and let's just listen into one more song. Sure. <laughs> Now this is just one song, and it's a it's a pretty how many in the cast? It's about well, it's a pretty small cast. Yeah, right? we have a cast of nine. And, nine. Um, yeah. and we just, and just you guys are all over the place, yeah. all over the stage, and I also love that it's kind of an intimate stage. We feel like we're right there with oh, you. Oh yes. Yeah. I mean, I would say that's one of the biggest um, changes with the revival. Mm -hmm. Is our director mm -hmm. Josh Bergoss really wanted us to go out into the audience and make the audience feel like you're in the bar with us. Yeah. And I think that we we achieve that kind of with the fact that we'll go out to the audience and Dwayne especially interacts. We have a lot some very with interactive moments yes. where I don't know the, if you guys, the audience yes. goes out and dances with the people in the, mm -hmm, in the aisles. Yeah. And it's an intimate space, stage 42, and um, just a good place to really tell these stories about the songs. I was gonna I was gonna say for people, a lot of people remember from when this was on Broadway. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, what if, for people who didn't see it the first time around, what what can they expect when they come to see this show? Um, a lot of dancing, yeah. <laughs> um, some powerhouse singing. We have a great cast. Um, uh, the stories, these these classic songs, you know, that yeah. are, are reimagined mm -hmm. in the way that feels fresh, but still con contains the essence of uh, telling those wonderful stories about love and acceptance, inclusivity. Um, yeah. They're really universal themes, um, and it's so funny how relevant they feel. And like my favorite number is Stand By Me, which yes. is yes. one of the Ours most too. popular songs in the world, actually, of uh, Mike Solars. And the fact that we can sing that every night, and especially in this political climate, how yes. coming together is something that's so important to us. And the fact that we get to sing about that is really special. That was my favorite song, too. That's, mm -hmm. the, that's the last song, just to <laughs> get you guys to that. Yeah, yeah. The whole show. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what was your favorite? What's your favorite moment in the My show? My favorite song is Smokey Joe's Cafe. Mm. Yeah. yeah. It's um, sort of a, a story about a guy who's in love with a girl that he shouldn't be in love with. Mm -hmm. You know, and the music, again, is really fun. There's dancing. There's a lot of acting and, and comedy going on with Kyle Taylor Parker. And uh, it's just a really fun song. Yeah. Well, and just in our last few seconds, for those of you, you're from South Carolina. Yes. You, your Swedish background yes. from California. Yes. What what advice do you have for people who hope to make it to the stage in New York, like you guys have? Oh wow, that's a big one. <laughs> I always say, be the star wherever you are first. Oh, that's great. Like really own where you are. Like yeah. sometimes we raise our children to believe that they haven't made it unless they're mm -hmm. in New York or unless yes. they're on Broadway, and that's not the trajectory for a lot of people. So like, really own who you are and live in the passion of what you're doing mm -hmm. so that if you do make it here great but if you don't still have that fire and passion to just live your dreams right i yeah. think just ha being able to be on any stage and being able to do this at any capacity is just so incredibly lucky um and to get to do it with yeah. this cast and with this group is just incredible. rejection we is real yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so get used to that yeah. get used thank to you that. both yeah. so much we can yeah. definitely see the fire and passion yeah. from you guys thank and your co-stars we appreciate you coming in mm -hmm. congratulations thank on you. the show smoky joe's cafe is running at stage 42 on 42nd street in the heart of times square